Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 29 of Let's Play Banjo Tooie, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. All right, we're still in Cloud Cuckoo Land, which is only bad because of one particular jiggy to try to get, and apparently you also get a Cheeto page this way too. All right, let's see where this flower actually takes me, because hi oh man, I got a lot of exploring to do. Luckily, the flight pads make it a little bit easier. Oh god. Okay, I see there's a jiggy. The problem is, I cannot get in there. I think I need to be Banjo all alone in order to make this happen. I don't know if the Clockwork Egg can actually reach this. Let's try it. Okay, exploding in midair does not work. So therefore, I need to be Banjo by himself. And then Shack Pack in there. Well, first we gotta find a split-up pack, because we haven't seen any throughout the entire level yet. And you just get sent back here automatically. Alright, that's fine. Let's just do a little bit of flying, then. Once we see where everything is, we might have an easier time getting around. No one's in the air! Defend your Jiggy at all costs! Oh, this could be a problem, then. Alright, so apparently these, uh, eyeball plants have a Jiggy. But I can't do anything about it. But why don't we go plant these seeds? I'd say if I plant those seeds, I might be able to make something good out of them. Alright, guess I can't do much here yet. Ugh, that's a big pile of cheese right there. I love cheese, but probably not to that degree. Okay, there's an egg over there that I can't do anything with. Again, I need to split up. And I don't know where you go to split up. Probably somewhere around here. Wow, come on. You can't really say that was pretty high up. Hey, where'd you go? Okay, I gotta get a lot of health now. Because I'm in a heap of trouble. <laughs> okay, Claw Clamber Boots over here. Oh, there's where you go to split up. Uh, I should probably just play as Banjo right now. Where would be the best place to go? Let me check out over here. Is this where I can go to get to that castle? Let's try it. Nope, it just takes you somewhere else. Okay, looks like I see a pile of money. Oh, I can't climb up there. Thank you for dying. Maybe I can do something about that if I'm back with Kazooie. We'll leave that alone for now. Why does there have to be so many of you jabronis? Like, really? Like, how many of you are there? In just one place. Okay, this is getting kind of ridiculous now. I might just die. Let's try our best not to die. Okay, that takes us over to a mumbo. Wait. Oh, no, no, never mind. That, that was a flight pad. I was thinking it wasn't for some reason. I was thinking, did I not hit a warp pad or something? And it turns out that's not a warp pad at all. It's a flight pad, which is disabled, because of course, Banjo doesn't have wings. I'm pretty sure he would like to go for some wings right now once his adventure is over. Just saying. I know I would. Okay, I think it was this flower that takes you to the jelly castle. There we go. This is where I need to be. on this side. Beautiful. Yay! We got ourselves a Jiggy in the jelly. Just when you thought it was safe to snooze in your pack, that happens! That dick hole. <laughs> now, I should be able to get to that move somehow. Wait, before I do that... Because remember, there was, like, a place to get to Jam Jars. 
but I gotta get to the other side of all this jelly. Maybe that will help me somehow. Wow, that's a rare Flotus Floatium creature! If I'm not mistaken! You're probably not. Okay. I see what I need to do. I'm thinking if Banjo takes that, he'll be able to float. So I think that's what you need to do. Like, you need to scoop this up. And then you'll start floating. But you only get, like, uh, 14 seconds of doing so. And right now, I think this is the only way you're gonna get over here. God, that Jinjo is gonna get so annoying, because I can't see him right now. And then it just disappears on ya. Luckily, he's fulfilling his purpose just by being here. Plant a seed! Watch it grow! Up the beanstalk, you will go! Who wrote that? Was it Grunty? Huh. <laughs> when faced by danger, jump on top! Now in the backpack, you can hop! Hope seed button and taps you up! Safely inside is where you'll be! I should just be doing it like the opposite of what I normally do. Because <laughs> just seeing that with jam jar is just awkward. But now, we have every single move we can learn. We're finally done with trying to look for jam jars. Only if we need to, like, recover our health would we really need him. I think we're in pretty good straits right now. Oh my god, take forever just getting around here. Like, seriously, you kill one and then another one shows up. It's like The Walking Dead. I've never watched The Walking Dead. Anyways, let's continue on here and just reunite. I think we're actually going to go to the water. Wait, there's a safe! What is that safe doing here? <sighs> Come on now. Come on now! Where are you guys coming from? Greetings, fleshy ones. Wow, a talking safe! Correct. I'm a Super Stash Deluxe. Four digit, infinite combination, reinforced strong box. But four digits only gives you 10,000 combinations! Hey, no one likes a wise guy. It's why it's enough up here. Let's have a look inside then. Oh, that might be a problem. I seem to have forgotten my own combination. Perhaps they should have spent a little more on your intelligence chip. I know. Sorry, fleshy ones. But if you can find the combination, I'll gladly open up. Remember, fleshy ones, if you can find my combination, you're welcome to anything that's inside me. Well, that sounded a little dirty, but... Okay, so we gotta find four buttons that can teach you the combination. And if I remember correctly, they had something to do with those uh, buttons that we saw much earlier. Like, for instance, there's one right here. Alright, let's see if I can actually just launch a clockwork egg over here. You can! Oh, that's so much better than just trying to climb across. Or grip grab across. Whenever you see those buttons, all you have to do is just blow yourself up on them. And you can do this in any order you want. So right now, one of the buttons, or one of the le numbers in the combination, is 9. Whoa, I need to get up there. Let's see if there's anything good up here. Wait a minute, is that a trouble clef? No, I think that looks like a sign, rather. Okay. I was misinformed. I wonder if there's anything good all the way up here to make you go through all this trouble just to climb up. Let's see. Okay, that looks like where event number three will take place against Mr. Fit. So let's do some looking around in this area. We might find some more, uh, I don't know, war pads, or possibly some more notes, or just bees. Actually, they're wasps. Well, there's a mumbo pad here. So we'll remember that for later. Wait a minute. Hang on. Can I get over this way? I think we're gonna get to go over here first. Can I reach it? Yes? No? Okay. I thought I could. 
It was a good effort, but it wasn't meant to be. Oh, wow! Look how far back they send you! Let's return to Central Cavern. I think I will actually go in the water this time. I said I was, then I didn't do it. So I guess that's the game's way of showing me. It's like, oh, you should have followed your gut there! What does that sign say, anyway? Have you looked in this pool yet? Well, I'm going to, you jerk! Give me a moment! Okay, I see a globo that I'd like to grab if the camera angles did not suck. Here, let me get into this view. That's better. Oh my god, there's even more water here. I don't think I've ever looked in this part of the water. I don't think I've looked in any water aside from where the globo was. And there's nothing in here right now, except some notes right next to this little opening. Let's see where this leads to. I am very curious now. Oh, that's where I tried to land on, but failed miserably. Hang on. There's a uh, boulder with Kazooie's mug on it. Uh, we just drained the water. Hopefully we can get up there. Where's this gonna fall into? Looks like it's going into Pterodactyl Land. Oh, you know what? We didn't even go here. But apparently there was supposed to be a dinosaur that was thirsty, but there was no water. He was around, you know, that giant T-Rex button? Yippee, my pool is full of water. Where did it all come from? The sky. And this dino will give you a jiggy if you, like, sate his thirst. Mm, tastes heavenly. Well, it did come from the clouds, Dippy. Did it? You said it wouldn't just droop from the sky. Or drop from the sky. I lied! Just drink it and be happy! Oh, I am. Here, take my odd-shaped gold tooth in exchange. And you get the last jiggy in from Pterodactyl Land instantly. But I will have to come back here eventually, because there's a Cheeto page in that pool. Okay, I was wondering, like, hope to God I'm not going to be losing air while I'm, like, in no water. Uh, turns out there's no way for me to get... Oh, wait, there is a way for me to get up here. There's just a few ledges. I will definitely be taking advantage of them. Let's see what awaits us in this little area. Uh, it's feathers. I think that's a war pad or a flight pad. I don't know. Nah, it's a flight pad. Okay. Well, that's good all the same. Um, I guess I can just fly here. There's more of those eyeball plants. Hopefully we can do something about them real soon. But I don't think we can in our present form. Because as soon as you take flight, they're coming after ya. Oh, wait a minute. There's another, uh, Mumbo Shaman hut. I think that's the real one. And then there's a fake one, obviously. Which you don't want to go to. Well, you do to get a Jiggy. But really, we just need to take care of this guy right here. Ow. Kind of deserve that one. Okay, what's behind him? Nothing. Alright, that's cool. Man, we're going to be so fragmented all around the place. Hey, it's a Minjo! That's pretty weird that you actually find, like, a real Jinjo in a fake Mumbo Hut, but then in the real Mumbo Hut, you find a, uh, fake Jinjo. I don't think I'm gonna give him the Globo yet. I think I'd rather give this one to Wumba, and then look for another Globo, and then deal with Mumbo later. Oh, we can actually climb up here. Why don't we do that? See where this takes us. I don't want to jump in that yet. I'll save that for later. Hang on a second, there's another egg! Oh, but we're not split up, so I gotta find a way to get over there. Maybe the claw clamber boots will make that happen. 
don't see the Jinjo anywhere either. I'm gonna get hurt, aren't I? Yep! Haha! <laughs> and then some. Oh, what the hell? Okay, that was bullshit. Okay, 65 notes found here. Not bad, if I say so myself. Oh my god, these guys are so relentless. Now, let's just, like, go around in here, shall we? Okay, that also takes you to Mumbo's. Um, I should go to Wumba first. First, I gotta find her. Oh, there she is. That didn't take too long! Ha <laughs> ha! Trash can over here. What's the easiest way to get over there? Wait a minute, before I do. Oh, you ass. Did I just miss that? Yeah, I missed that. I'll come back for it later. But for now, let's go see Wumba. Why does your, like, land formation look like something you'd see in Star Wars? It almost looks like a Naboo Starfighter. Oh, just missed that flower. That would have been so cool if I hit it. Oh, no, 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 no. Screw you, Mary. I've had it up to here with your shit for one day. Okay, let's see what's in here. Believe it or not, I think a Jinjo is nearby. Wasn't there supposed to be a Jinjo somewhere in here? I feel like there should be one. Or maybe I'm just thinking things. Like, climb up here, actually. Or maybe I'm wrong. Wait. That might have been... Oh, wait! A Jinjo is here! Where is it, anyway? Maybe I climb up here. Where is it exactly? It's not one of these jars. Maybe if I give her the globo and then use the move. Here you go. It's all yours. I'll give the other one to Mumbo. Jump in Wumbo pool. I will. I should not talk in that accent. I really shouldn't. <laughs> Alright, we're a bee. Remember this from Banjo Kazooie? Wumba call this B! Press A to jump and A again with an air to fly! Use control stick to steer and press A to fly higher! I also press Z for a stinger attack! Oh, you actually get an attack this time! Oh, there's a Jinjo! It was up there on that pile of wood. Um. If I can grab it. Oh my god. And the steering in this is so jank. I wish you can just like stop in like midair and then just turn around and then fly towards what you want to get to. This will take a while. I promise you that. My flying is so bad. Can I just shoot this thing to grab it? Oh my lord. Like, really? Just get the goddamn Jinjo. Maybe I was better off as just Banjo Kazooie to grab the Jinjo and then come back as the bee. Oh, we finally. Damn it. I want to be back as the bee, okay? <laughs> oh, that was so annoying. Now I gotta come back as the bee. Like, to be or not to be? That is the question, and to be is the answer. For now. That'll change real soon, once I no longer need to be the bee. To be the bee, god. This is gonna sound so bad. Alright, find out where all those eyeball plants are. Rick, you fool! Pass the jiggy on! Oh, now it's gone to another eyeball plant. Wait a minute, I see an ice cube. And not the wrapper, either. 
Can't do anything with that one, apparently. Maybe I just gotta talk to it. Sorry, but I only talked to Banjo or Kazooie. How do you know who we are? Like, really? Whatever. Let's just go get that, uh, honeycomb piece that I saw much earlier. Oh, if you hold B, you can go faster. That's pretty cool. Oh, I missed it? Really? Dang, son. I'll go after those Zubbas if I have to. Got it! Beautiful. Um, where was the other honeycomb piece? I think it was somewhere around the pot of gold, actually. So let me go for that one first. Well, we still can, actually. Wait a minute, can I hit this? Oh, no, I can't. I'm too light. Ooh, I almost fell to my death there. Invisible walls. <laughs> Okay, there's the last honeycomb piece. There, we have grabbed every single honeycomb piece in the game. No more to get. There's that other eyeball plant. There we go. Where are you gonna pass it off to? Oh, just above Mumbo's. Okay, I know where that is. Just on this ledge I'm flying to right now. I think I'll fly up to the top of the mountain real soon. How many more of these things are there? Okay, it's just to the left. We're close to the left on uh, where Minky Jongos was. I don't want to fly too high up because I don't really need to be there. I think it's this ledge. Is it this ledge? Or is it just further ahead? be over here, actually. No, it's not. Okay. Oh, oh, it might be this one. My rear eyeball is chicken plants! You killed them all! Yeah, I did. You got a problem with it? Well, obviously you do, but I don't care. I'll be taking this now. It's mine. Alright, now we just need to fly up here. Okay, that looks like something for Zubbas. Let me just fly to the front of this. Let me give myself a nice view. And then we just shoot at it. That looks like a target. Now zoot this lots of times. Okay. Did it! Nice zooting. Why not come inside? Okay. I gotta get into the hole. Alright, let's do it. Before we take care of a lot of other things, if I can get most of this stuff done as a bee, then I probably won't need it for the rest of the game. Try to get some tests done so you don't have to, like, uh, keep going back and forth all the time. That's pretty much the best way to do things. Now, just get in here. This hole is just wide enough for us. It almost looks like the opening of a butthole, I swear to God. Greetings, as you can see, we Zubbas have a new nest to celebrate. We've arranged a little shooting game. If you score 40 points or more, we'll give you a prize. Manage to beat 50 points, then there's an extra special prize for you. Do you need any instructions? No, I think all I gotta do is shoot you guys. Ready? 3, 2, 1, go. I think if you just go in this view, you get a good view of pretty much all the Zubbas. Remember, red ones are worth one, green ones are two, and blue ones are worth three. These, these Zubbas are like in a, such a bright color. It reminds me of a bug's life for some reason. You shoot so fast, which is really nice. It's just turning that's an absolute pain in the balls. But because of you, you're able to shoot so rapidly, 
you might be able to hit so many Zubas so easily just by constantly moving the analog stick. Okay, I think I should have both prizes. Good. Prizes. Come on. You gotta get in that kind of groove, too. Let's try to see what how, how many points I can get. Seventy-four, not bad. You just scored enough to win second prize, which is a Cheeto page. Oh my god, I'm slanted! You also got enough to win the first prize, too. Yay, that's a jiggy. Alright. Burning the midnight oil with all the things we need to grab. Alright, which uh, pedestal is where the uh, Cheeto pages are to? Is it... Oh, I can't see it. Oh, it's this one. Man, the thing I hate about flying is that you can't just stop. Oh, come on. You fly over things so easily. Let's see how low I can get. And then just tap A, see what happens. Ah, oh, so close. Oh. There we go, that's better. Again, this would be so much better if you can just, like, stop in midair. That way you just have a little bit more control, but you don't. You have little to no control, it's sad. Come on, get it, get it, get it! Yes! Good. Do you want to play again? No. I'm done with this place. Now, could I actually be the bee inside the cave? I don't know. Let's check it out. I would like to know, because if I can and just fly inside, that may not be so bad. Once I get that exploration taken care of, then I'll just revert to Baron Bird. I would like to get to that ice cube too, because I think he'll help me out for that, uh, pig quest in Jolly Roger's Lagoon. Is that the Trouble Clef? I think I see the Trouble Clef. And more regular notes, too, of course. Oh, what? Come on, now. That's better. Oh, man. This would be a terrible, like, a uh, sobriety test. I'm telling you that much right now. Apparently, there's, like, one more nest of notes. Don't you buzz into me. Thank you. Okay. Where's the last set of notes? Not in here, apparently. But it would have to be, like, an opening inside the cave. They're not anywhere else, really. Oh, I think I see the Jinjo. I think I can get it from here. So I hope that's a Jinjo, not a Minjo. Yay! Let's check the totals, because we haven't done that in a while. Uh, four Jiggies, not bad. All the honeycomb pieces... One out of three Cheeto pages, one Globo, 95 notes, three Jinjos, and all the moves. That is pretty solid. Oh yeah, we're also missing like a lot of pieces of the combination. So we'll definitely need to get that straight away real soon. Oh, that's where the water was. We'll come back to Pterodactyl Land for that final Cheeto page in that area later on. But for now, we gotta do a little bit more exploring. I think all the notes are actually inside. Wait a minute, have I not been in here? Okay, I have not been in here. And I don't think you can go inside the water as a bee. Well, you can't go inside the water as a bee, you die! Realistically speaking, not like really speaking, because, well, you don't- I didn't die. I just couldn't do it. Now, let's just continue on and see what we need to do. 
well, obviously I'll need to revert back to being the Baron Bird. But let's see where there's a... Uh, what's in around this pile of cheese? Oh, get out of there, you. Wait a minute, if I'm the bee, I wonder if I can do this. There's a flight pad. Hey! You can't get in here as that sort of creature! Why not? It's a free country, I can do whatever I want. Or should I say it's a bee country? I'll show myself out. Anyways, I think I'm just gonna revert back to the barren bird right now. Good, death from above! How you like me now? Alright, so, once I'm back to Baron Bird, we're gonna stop the video, and then we're just gonna think of our next move, and there's a lot of them, actually, if I can be completely honest here. It's gonna be so frustrating to figure them out. One of them we already know, and I'm dreading with every moral fiber of my being. I just wish I could be the bee and just give Canary Mary, like, an allergic reaction, and then I'll win by forfeit. But that does not work. Sadly. So, in the next episode, we'll be exploring more of Cloud Coco Land. Hopefully it won't take too many videos. Goodbye, everyone.